Hi, I'm going to show you exactly how to unlock a BlackBerry 8120 GSM phone. Um, this process can unlock a BlackBerry 8120 on any GSM network around the world. So follow the step-by-step -step process and by the end of it, you will have an unlocked BlackBerry 8120. Alright, now we're going to do the unlocking of the, of the um, BlackBerry. So I'll show you step-by-step -step here on exactly what you need to do for the unlocking process of it. Um, first of all, you'll notice it says insert SIM card, so I need to insert a SIM card into this phone. So I'm going to insert a SIM card. Alright, so I've inserted a SIM card into the phone. Anyone who has a BlackBerry knows how the great um, turn on time and how long it takes. So I, I will power that on and then I will show you the exact steps. Um, of course there's also written um, steps of this which um, you uh, will get or should have got um, as well with this video that will walk you step by step through exactly what I'm doing. So the first step is to um, obviously insert your SIM card into the phone. Um, I've inserted a FIDO SIM card which is a SIM card that doesn't work with this phone. You can see it's a Rogers and I've inserted a FIDO. So um, you power on the phone and you turn off the radio, so make sure that the wireless is actually off. Um, it's very important to make sure of this when you're unlocking the uh, BlackBerry Pearl. As you know, this process will work on the 8100, the 8110, the 8120, any basically BlackBerry Pearl. The 8300s have a very similar process, like example here you're going to press an MEPPD, there you'll press an MEPD. Um, so I'll show, you, I'll show you that in a second. But it's uh, really it's really similar. If you haven't checked out the Global Unlock ebook yet, definitely do that. Um, it, also, the Global Unlock toolbar, um, accredited by Better Business Bureau, uh, needing help call our 800 number. There's a lot of stuff I can tell you, um, and why we're a credible source for doing business with and unlocking phones. Been doing this for about five years. Okay, so um, now I've killed some time doing that. Um, let me actually show you the process. So I'm going down to applications, right? Uh, it says invalid SIM card. You see the invalid SIM card message on there? And applications. So uh, you can actually put the original SIM card in, or you could put in an invalid SIM card. You just need to have a SIM card in. And with the original SIM card, you have to make sure your wireless is off. With this, you don't. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go. I need to find options. So I found options. I'm going to click on options. Now I'm going to click on advanced options. That I'm going to go and I'm going to find SIM card. Click on SIM card. Now I'm typing in Michael Edmund Peter Peter David M E P P D. Now you see where it says active. That shows you that this phone is still locked. If it said uh, disabled, that means that your phone's actually already unlocked. So now I'm going to what I'm going to do next is I'm going to actually type in uh, hold on, M E P P Alt two. So Michael Edmund. Peter Peter all two. Now I have 250 tries left on this phone. I haven't tried to unlock it yet. If that gets to zero, um, good, good luck in doing that. It's pretty tough. It took a lot of time to do that. Uh, so if you put in the wrong code too many times, um, that's what it will come down to. Also, this code will not work on your phone because the unlock code is unique for each phone. So make sure that you have your unlock phone, globalunlock.com, and that will work on your phone. Um, Actually, you know what? Let me show you two things. Let me actually show you where I'm just going to put in the wrong number. I've just typed in numbers. Code error. Please wait. What does that mean? That means that obviously uh, it did not work because I put in the wrong unlock code. Now let me show you uh, myself doing it right. Michael Edmund Peter Peter Alt 2. And I'm going to put in 232 seven five seven five six so that is the correct unlock code so I'm going to enter it in the phone then I'm going to hit the job code accepted now you notice that it said disabled here um, and you'll notice that um, the phone number four one six eight five seven seven six zero one is on here that's a global unlock phone number uh, one of the numbers and you call one eight six six nine nine unlock so now you'll also notice that it says Rogers wireless so we actually picked up a network